Good morning, y'all. I wanted to talk to you about one of my cool hacks for this piece of furniture and what I have going on in this whole area. Um, my kitchen's fairly small. I mean, some people's are obviously smaller, but for our family, it's tight and um, I don't have as much storage as I would like. And so what I found for $50, yes, $50, is an office desk credenza thing. And um, I wanted to point that out to you and show you why it is so awesome. Um, we have our caffeinated um, Breville espresso machine up here, which is really awesome. And I just made my first cup of coffee with. Um, and then over here, we have our smaller one, which is our original. And this one oh, makes more noise. Um, and it's our decaf one. Um, in the middle, I have coffee cups, I have a little light that I got at a garage sale, candle, um, our reserve coffee. If you don't know what Breville is, basically you're taking fresh coffee beans and you stick them into the hopper, it grinds them there. And so every cup of coffee is made with fresh coffee beans, which we love. Also, this became more than just a coffee station. It also became a um, drink station with all of our teas. Um, we really like this. I'm not sure where I got it, but basically you could just push the button, decide what kind of tea or drink you're having, and it heats to the right temperature. You pour it in one of your cups, and then you can grab from our tea section over here. I found this awesome thing on Amazon. It's got like little drawers, and so it has a lot of our teas. We have a whole other drawer, but uh, this works really great uh, for people, especially guests coming over and getting teas. You have to make sure you get the right size because whatever this is, it doesn't fit in there. Um, so you just have to play with that. There's certain brands that are easier and better than others, but um, it gets tight with some of them. But there you go, it gives you nine um, different choices on three different shelves. So that works really great for us. And then over here, this is a mess because I have kids, but it's everything from hot cocoa um, to vanilla cocoa. Um, there's all kinds of things just mixed in here. Um, there's chocolate coffee, tea. Um, what is this? This is another Swiss Miss with mom. Just all kinds of stuff. So you get the idea. And this, once again, was another Amazon find. I'm not sure where it is or the link. Um, and then over here, we have the honeys and some of the syrups. We don't use these that much. And then way back here, we have some marshmallows too. Um, so this is kind of like our overfill drink station because we have so much of this stuff. Then I was like, I also need storage for all my baking and such and so I don't even know what's in here quite honestly I'm going through it with you this morning oh this is the overflow for all the coffee stuff like the these are the little deals that you can swap out for this to make the perfect coffee these are the espresso shots you know the filters the cleaners all that so that makes it very convenient to have a drawer this drawer is not a normal drawer I'm going to show you why um, it, it, it did open just now, but it also has this unique feature where this part can fold down. I'm not exactly sure. I guess that's just because, oh, it's for a computer. So you could have a computer here and this would be your keyboard station. So this is obviously old. So we have to make sure that that's up and it's tight. And in here right now, it's, I just have some tea and some monk fruit. So there's that. And this is one of my favorite features of about having a credenza. <laughs> Old office, $50 credenza is because you can unlock this to get the things open. Now, obviously a kid was in here and got my xanthan gum. I've got my real salt in here and obviously I need to clean that out. Um, always real here, <laughs> no pre-planned. Um, and then this drawer is a mess too, but let me just show you, it's cool. I'm, I'm totally okay with the fact that this is a mess because it's just got all kinds of random stuff. It was beautiful and clean, but like I said, I have kids. Everything from cornstarch and molasses, um, glucobon, um, and then they've obviously opened and not repackaged back in plastic. But these are dates. Um, we've got walnuts, chocolate chips, almonds. Here's a mix. Um, usually it's supposed to be up there, so we'll move that over there. 
Um, I also have tried this, which is buttermilk um, blend. And so instead of having buttermilk in your house all the time, you can get this powder and then you mix it up with water and boom, there's your buttermilk for baking. Um, I also have things like peppermint extract, vanilla, strawberry, you get the idea. So just, this is all my, uh, these are pecan chips. I just really need to clean it out, but you get the idea. Then the next drawer is one of my absolute favorite drawers because not only is this a lot of heavy weight and I can easily slip it and slide it back in, but once it's slid in, you just, this whole row is locked. So that's pretty cool. So back to this. Um, I have all the different kind of big baking things in here. I've got corn syrup which I don't know why I have two in here, honestly. I think I could have stuck that in here. That's my excuse for a lot of this. I hid in one of these, which I'm gonna have to take upstairs. Um, I've got some condensed milk here for quick access because we have more upstairs. Pumpkin puree. Um, we've got these big chocolate discs. Um, they were out of Hershey's Kisses at one point. And so the little baking chocolates, um, a lot of those. I get these from Azure Standard, the chocolate chips semi-sweet from Azure Market. And then um, we have Gardelli's. Um, those are in here. This is butterscotch and I'm putting everything, um, it's labeled and it's in the jars. Um, what else is in here? We've got sugar replacement, which I was trying to do with baking, um, white chocolate chips, and the list just goes on. What is this? It'll say graham crackers. That's right, I did graham crackers. Kit Kat. Um, rapid Rise Yeast. These are candies. I don't even know why these are here. These aren't supposed to be here. Um, Oh, this is more, um, this is toffee. Um, I got like some kind of dessert pack and that's what the Kit Kats and that is. Um, I've got some more baking powder down here. I've got some baking cups. You get the, oh, more Hershey's, um, more butterscotches. This is a coffee grinder for all kinds of things. I'm gonna clean this out today, so I'm just gonna leave that. Anyways, so I feel pretty good about all that storage. Over here, let's see. Okay, I've got some elderberry powder. Um, or actually elderberries. I've also squished it into elderberry powder for things, but these are elderberries I bought. Um, this is honey, little mini honeys that I got at Sprouts, I'm pretty sure. And these are really convenient if you're making like a tea or you're taking it. But I also put these in my little um, snack bag that I carry with me in my car in case my blood glucose gets too low or I just feel like I need a bit of energy. I'll throw this on like a cracker or something, love them. Um, this is in here. Chocolate and marshmallows seem to be the theme of this area. Um, and then over here, I've got more stuff. Over here, I've got some big, big, huge um, measuring cup pours. I've got almond flour, lethal, another cake mix, more chocolate chips, um, gelatin that's from Trim Healthy Mama gelatin. Um, what in the heck? Oh, that's Trim Healthy Mama baking blend. And I really haven't honestly used it that much. I, I need to do some more recipes. I've got several cookbooks. Um, just different sugars and sweeteners and things like that. Trim Healthy Mama baking blend because I think it's a head overflow. So lots of lots of storage. This one just shuts and it doesn't have a key. I don't understand why. I guess this is just where they needed all their personal stuff. Okay, now down here, is the best part because look at how much storage I have. You guys, I paid 50 bucks and I got a drink station, a coffee station, a baking station. I just feel like this was such a win. Um, and like I said, I do not pre-plan the videos. I just say, oh, this is a good topic. So uh, it's not cleaned, it's, all, it's just my real life. Um, but I've got sugar, different kinds of sugar bread flour, all-purpose flour, um, powdered sugar. Um, back there, there's more powdered sugar. What the heck is this? Oh, these, these don't belong in here, but these are chocolate chunks. 
This is why it's good for me to come back here every once in a while and look. I got brown sugar, bisquick, other uh, other flowers. Um, this is a this is an all natural flower mix, and it's got things like almond and coconut flour and such mixed in there. Back there's coconut, and back there is salt. So I am able to fit all of this stuff with storage that makes sense, you know, to organize. Obviously it's not the best organized right now, but it's much better in the past. But you can have the different compartments for the different items. You can have lots of drawers, you can hide things. And so this is just office desk credenza. And I mean, I just think it's such a great deal. Now I've got to go and clean and organize all this. But just reimagine furniture when you're out looking at, um, Facebook marketplace or resales or estate sales or whatever that looks like because this is one of my favorite things in my whole kitchen because it works so well um, and it's such a good price and I think it looks pretty too actually if you look on the side you can see it's got some molding and it, it works you know I mean obviously there's a few older stains but you know what it gives it character I'm fine with it and it fills the function so hopefully that gave you some ideas and you like the desk credenza and uh, I guess that's it have a good day